today that today. Let me so. <laughs> we're gonna meet our people there. We can't tell them. We're gonna see them. All the area boys, aka Omaeta, aka Mafo Motunori. Uh, let me know. That's area boy, Jonti, but <laughs> our area boys name me. Alright. The translation is we are gonna strictly be listening to Afrobeats and he wants all the <laughs> gang members to come to the concert <laughs> and shake up London. <laughs> <laughs> Susan is somewhere there. Look at her, running, running, running into the vlog, running into the vlog. What's happening, people? So we are back. We're back, guys. Are you excited? I'm very excited. Um, it's my birthday coming soon. Happy Woo! birthday. Happy, let me do what Nigerians do. Happy birthday in advance. <laughs> yeah, so today we are going to have an early birthday treat for myself. Yes, indeed. Thanks to Corey. Yes, indeed. And we are going to see David I give my baby assurance. I give my baby, baby lifetime insurance. Eh, 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 comment and subscribe and make sure you subscribe because we've got decent decent um contents coming yeah. um for those of you guys that are new to this channel that have been subscribing we notice every single one of you guys so do interact this is one of those channels where we post videos and you just watch and disappear we want to know what you're thinking guys yeah. so comment on the comment section and below we always respond as literally as so once again if you think susan is cute <laughs> comment on the comment section <laughs> and i'm sure she'll reply if you think uh, you know the beard is game is strong or whatever comments will interact with you guys so we've got susan coming down here you can stop there baby um giving us a little twirl there we go there we go denim blue denim jacket it's got some rips in it um we've got a white t-shirt well white yes. vest we've got a fanny pack there with your combat trousers and some boots give us a little zanko go on go on <laughs> He's got the khaki hat, the pink hoodie. Give us a twirl. Wearing um denim, light blue denim jacket, navy jeans, um some air forces. Oh, and then the beard, I can't forget the beard, accessory of life. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, <laughs> all right. Ah. Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> and the weather's looking good. <laughs> the weather, you know. Uh, not lie, not lie. Weather is terrible. Trash. Yeah, but it's not draining. So but it's not raining. Yeah, it's yeah. not raining. But it's better than rain. Cause rain will be really, yeah. really bad. So today, today, eh, the Afro beat day. You understand? Strictly Afro beat. Strictly Afro beat. So I go no say. Today that today, let me so. <laughs> we're gonna meet our people there. <laughs> our people, you understand? We're gonna arm not on the shake today. We're gonna scatter them. We're gonna tear them. Where they want? All the area boys, aka Omaeta, aka Mafo Motunori. Who are you shooting? That's area boys, you know what I'm saying? Our area boys, let me. Alright, alright, alright. So, yeah. The translation is we are going to strictly be listening to Afrobeats and he wants all the 
<laughs> gang members to come to the concert <laughs> and shake up London. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, we'll catch you when we get to the O2. Only food would make you dance like this. <laughs> there's no music playing, there's no nothing. But the moment she starts reading, <laughs> reading the menu, she starts to dance. <laughs> <laughs> Susan got the, what was it? Double cheeseburger. Yeah. Can you like stop dancing? <laughs> this is the dancing. Thank you. Are we here to a concert or is this girl actually shopping? I went to drop the food in the car, I come back and, and this girl's dude shopping. So maybe she can't get this bag, yeah? That's right, let's go to the till. I got you. Let's go then. Is that the one? Is that all you're getting? I do like it, yeah. I like it. So is that all you want? Yeah, for now. Anything else I want, I want nothing. So, um, I go downstairs now to put the food in the car. Yeah. I come upstairs and guess who's in Ted Baker? <laughs> See this there. And guess who got me a beautiful bag? Like, it's not even my birthday present, but I like the bag and I was like, let's get it. Thank you, babe. Because it was a trap. I love you. It was a trap. <laughs> it really wasn't. I'm used to your traps already. It wasn't a trap. No, I'm taking, I'm taking, I'm taking. Babes, we've got to go put that in the car before we go in. Yes. Yeah. So let's go. All right. What's up, guys? So we are finally queuing up for the David O concept. Um, Finishing it in, obviously. Just roll around, obviously. Cold. And right now we are in entrance B. We're about to enter the OTO arena. <laughs> so we are in the OT right now, going upstairs to see David Looking forward to it, we're excited and we know it's gonna be a great show. And also we're also looking forward to like the acts yep. the acts that are gonna come in support of David O because we actually like their music as well. So yeah. Popcorn. This popcorn. Popcorn what I get for house. Hello, you're all right there? Eh? Yeah, well sweet mate. Popcorn what I get for house, now we to the contact me. I'm an electro, you understand? <laughs> See what I get for house. So this is what it's like to be in O2, in O2. You've never been here before. Yeah, not been here for a concert. Yeah. But, hello. Me with this 
Before we begin, let us say happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. It's Susan's birthday today. She yes. is one year more gorgeous, as you can see. Mm -mm -mm. Show it to them. Give it to them. Give it to them. Eh, why should it? Ah! <laughs> anyway, so yeah, so today we're just gonna go out for a dinner. Um, we're gonna go out for dinner. We're gonna go out for, for, let, go for out brunch. brunch. Brunch, yeah. yeah it's, it's, it's fuzzy. It's fuzzy. There we go. It's back to normal. We're going out for brunch in yeah. Hakkasan. In Hakkasan. Yeah. And I'm really happy that it's my birthday today. I mean, um, it's been a good year. Like yeah. last year has been amazing, and I feel like this year is even gonna be better. But it I'm is. really, really happy. I feel like completely content in every yeah. area of my life. That's good. And I thank God for that. That's very good. That's very good. And so, I'm happy that you're happy as well. Yeah. Evidently. So you know what? Like we're actually running late. So as always. We're gonna always crack late. on. We're gonna crack on with it. I've got a few presents for Susan, which I'm gonna give to her. And um, I'm sure we know she's them, happy. Because you got me this bag. Oh, this I don't think they've seen it properly. I'm right, go on, show, show off your bag. Show your bag. Show your oh, bag. This is my bag that Corey got me on the day Do you of like the it? concert. I love it. That's good. It's so pretty. <laughs> and it goes with my Bracelet, because it's Ted Baker. Hey. This girl, Ted Baker, listen, if you guys are watching this, please endorse this girl. Seriously, <laughs> endorse her, because she loves everything Ted Baker. Like, for real, for real, <laughs> you guys need to endorse her, because I'm running out of money. <laughs> okay, ready? Three, two, one. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. So, here. So, Suzanne. Wait, don't, 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 what is she doing? Don't touch it. <laughs> don't touch it. There we go. So now it's focused. There we go. Right, so Susan, you give hints a lot. And you give hints of presents that you would like and so on and so forth. And of course, I do grab onto those hints. I am a husband who pays attention. And I've gotten you this, which is something that you wanted. Go on, open it. Hurry up. We ain't got all day. We need to go. Remember, we need to go. So I need to... Crack hard, crack hard, crack hard. As I said, she loves her Ted Baker. <laughs> she loves her Ted Baker. Oh. Go on. Oh my god! Come with the necklace, thank you so much. I love it. It goes with my bracelet. Do you want to try it on? Of course. Cool. Thank you, Bean. There we go, that's your necklace right there. It goes with my bead, I mean my It goes with your bracelet. Right there. And you've got your bracelet there also. You're looking like you're looking. And of course, 
I had to, you know I just don't do like, I don't do my things like that. I don't just do one thing and this. Excuse me, pay attention here. I don't just do my thing like that and then leave it. I always have to top myself. So there we go again. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up, please. Oh, make yeah, kind of yeah. day, make yeah. kind of day. I have to save it a moment. Oh, thank you, baby. Chop, 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 chop. Oh, I'm so happy. Chop, chop, let's go, let's go, girl. Good. Make kind of day. You know why I love this? Because I really don't have many gold jewelry. Yeah. I have silver, I have so much silver. Right, so you've got the necklace, you've got the matching earrings. the earrings now. And I've got the bracelet. And you've got the bracelet. I am all kitted out. I've got my collection. Okay, that's great stuff, baby. So now this is where the flip scripts on you now. And I love this moment all the time. Well, I know that's what you wanted. <laughs> but in all honesty, that wasn't what I wanted for you. Okay? So now that you've got what you want, I'll give you want. I'll give you I'll give to you what <laughs> I want for you. Okay, so just one oh my second. Oh gosh, you're so extra. <laughs> I know I'm extra. Oh, I really love my earring and necklace though. I love it. It's beautiful. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, baby. Ah! <laughs> I went into the Berlin to begin with. I went into the Berlin to begin with. Happy birthday. And oh, I know it did, it did. That's what you saw yesterday, oh, but no. you didn't know it was. Okay, babe, just pay attention here. And remember, I've always been hounding you about just doing something nice for you because you really care about me you care about us and you're always doing things for us and I want you to do things for yourself that's why I've literally I'm going to give to you this money. <laughs> this money literally for you to just do your own shopping just do whatever you want to do baby it's all for you you don't need to count and say how much I don't need to count to say how much it is but you can bring it out splurge with these people let them know yeah, that you're born you. and for you to do it as you wish Literally, voila, voila. like for real, for real. So there we go, baby. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you, baby. Happy birthday, happy birthday baby. Cash. Happy birthday. Thank Love you. you. Love you too. Love you. <laughs>right now Susan and I want to take the opportunity um, of this moment to give you guys some advice and I particularly want to speak to the men and you know though the guys who actually watch our videos who watch our vlogs um, I would like to give you a word of advice and the word of advice is as a man it is of course it's well known that it's your responsibility to look after your woman but I would advise from of course not that we do all of what we do to show off not that we do all of what, what we do to prove a point we do all of what we do because this is how we live our lives this is how um i express my love to my wife this is how i express how much she means to me um and um of course you know in my opinion it's not even enough i don't feel like i do enough for you i don't feel like um i have reached my 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 fullest potential that's why of course i'll work hard every day and you know what i mean i, I just want to do more for you yeah. seeing her happy makes me extremely happy um having said that you know i would really advise the guys out there to pay attention to their missus pay attention to your relationship the same way that you would pay attention if you had a job if you were at your workplace and you would want to see yourself grow in your career um and you would you know you would gauge your career progress in a sense um and where you were last year you wouldn't want to be tomorrow you wouldn't want to be you know there the following year so you just want to see that progress and i would advise the same in your relationship as well yep. where we were last you know two years ago is not where we are today yeah. and i'm not talking about financially as well um i'm but talking within about the relationship. within our relationship the way that i express my love to you yeah. Um, the understanding you know, we have for each other. The understanding we have to, for each other. Even the understanding I have with myself about the about our relationship. Mm -hmm. My patience towards you. Um, you know the things that would that I would do if I were to be angry back in the days. On the things that I would do today. So there is a progress in our relationship. You know where I'm coming from. Yeah. And I'd advise the guys out there to pay attention to their relationships and you know treat your wife like mate. I don't understand how some men could actually tell me oh. You love your wife a lot, man. You love your wife. <laughs> it's like, are you insane? Are you like, not supposed to? <laughs> how can you not love your wife? How can you not do everything for your wife? Like, do you know what this woman does for me? Do you get where I'm coming from? Mm -hmm. Like, it's just utterly insane. Like, bro, if you know your woman is taking care of you, hey, put her before anyone or anything. Straight up.
Let me go, son. <laughs> let me not go, son. Oh, I'm gonna have my main. That's my main right now. It's very um tight size portions. <laughs> Baby portions. This is the um what is this? Veg pak choy. Thank you so much. Oh, that looks actually cute. Yeah. Right there. Right in the middle, but it's not. Oh, no way. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, go yeah. The magic happened. Looks like a big rice crispy. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. That is amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Ready? <laughs> I taste it. Let's see what it tastes like. I've stored up for so long. Oh, okay. Oh, 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 okay. It's like ice cream. Is it? I don't, I want, I don't want it to get. Come on, stop it. Go on. How does it taste? Mm. guys so we are back from Hakkasan and I just remembered that in the car Koi gave an advice for guys and things like that and I just thought I need to give my own advice well we already planned for me to give advice too so my advice would be that I think not all women but I think sometimes women feel like before they have a man or when they have a man then it's a man's duty or responsibility to you know be the hard-working one be be there like constantly there for them be um, ready and available to foot the bill whenever they go out whenever they do things plan extravagant trips you know just constantly treat their woman and by all means that is right a guy should do that for their for their woman however I feel as though women should actually take that initiative to see it as yes I want a man to do all of that for me but I myself can actually bring to the table equally what the guys bring into the table if you expect your man to be earning a certain amount then you yourself have to have that ambition to earn that amount if you want your man to you know be able to you know like handle business handle situations problems i feel like you should be capable and equipped to handle those types of issues or problems that you expect a man to what i'm trying to say is i feel as though women a lot of times they have this sort of list of things that they want from a man and requirements before they can actually be with that particular person but think to yourself what are you actually bringing to the table can you actually say to yourself that I am equally bringing the same thing or even more to the table and I just feel like sometimes we should think as ladies we should actually think because you are only gonna attract what you are you can't be someone lazy you can't be someone who you know you just want to you just want a man who's ready-made and you're just going to sit around and just do nothing like no man is going to be attracted to that <laughs> I'm, I'm just saying you like that a man is going to see that from you a man is going to already see that okay this 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 woman she, she's really not about that life of grinding she's more about the life of yeah i'm just going to chill go shopping do what i want to do and all of that so i feel as though you need to put yourself and you need to present yourself in a way that that you what you want to attract you need to present yourself as what you want to attract and I just think people like women should dwell on that should think about that and in future rather than just wanting a guy to come ready-made and have all the boxes ticked I feel as though you yourself should think to yourself what what have I got if your man is down if your if your man hasn't got a job then think to yourself how can I help him how can I rather than just like cussing them out or complaining I'm gonna actually do applications on his behalf I'm gonna say babe let me see your CV let me make corrections let me make some tweaks let me apply for jobs for you whilst I'm at work send me your CV put it on a USB and I'll make those applications for you like do you understand like just be there to actually support this man in the same way you want a man to support you you want a man to be there for you you want a man to look after you I feel like us women we need to do the same for our men we need to look after them we need to be ready to be there for them not be a a, a, a a walking mat for them but you need to also be strong you need to also be courageous you need to also be ready to put in the work and I feel like if you are all of those things there's no way you're gonna attract someone who doesn't meet up to your expectations 
no way <laughs> so yeah that's just my advice oh. hello guys so we are there. back home we are back from Pakistan. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Pakistan was good. It was yeah. really nice. We yep. had a three course meal, as you obviously saw. Um, I liked it. I really liked it. And I, li I liked my um, my birthday cake thing that they did. That was really, really, really nice. I did not expect that from them. The food was good. That's like the food was really. Really, really good. I would have liked a bit more. It was so good that I actually wanted more yeah, portions. Yeah, portion could have been bigger. Could have been bigger. But no, it was fine. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. So birthday cake time for Susan. So Corey needs to prepare Susan's birthday that cake. Is low. Yeah, I know. Well, I'll change it in a minute. So I need to prepare your birthday cake. Are you ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Get going. There we go. You can come forward. Oh, oh, I love it. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, they don't want to light up. Two, one, happy birthday! <laughs> uh, is there anything you want to say? How's your day been? How's the year been? Um, Where are you? What's I'm, happening? I'm just going to round it up really quickly, but they have been perfect, amazing. I just want to thank everybody who wished me a happy birthday. I really appreciate you taking the time to actually wish me a happy birthday. It's been an amazing birthday. The year has been great. I can't complain. It's been beautiful. Um, I know this year is going to be even better and I'm just so happy that I'm alive to see another year. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> and thank you to my husband, my beautiful husband, thank who you. is behind the camera. Um, You're welcome, baby. You're welcome. He has made... He has made this day perfect. Thank you so much, baby. I appreciate you. Appreciate everything you've done for me. This and, is less than what you deserve. And for making this birthday one to remember for all the right reasons. And that's pretty much that. Thank you guys for Thank watching guys our for vlog. Watching. And um, hope you like, comment, and subscribe for more yes, videos. Indeed. Yes, indeed. And uh, we'll see you soon. Yes, indeed. Right. Yeah. See you guys later. Bye. Bye bye.